Bhagavad Gita, verse 4.24. In the performance of a fire sacrifice, yagya, in which the instruments for offering, such as spoon, the ingredients to be offered, such as ghee, the place where the offering is made, the sacrificial fire, the person making the offering, the priest, and the act of offering itself are Brahma, or spiritual in nature, and meant for the revelation of Brahma, transcendence. Indeed, Brahma is the fruit obtained by a person who is one-pointedly absorbed in seeking revelation of Brahma in the performance of such action. Sarvadvarshini The previous verse states that one should perform work as an act of sacrifice, yagya, to the Supreme. What is the nature of such sacrifice? In anticipation of this question, Sri Bhagavan speaks this verse beginning with the word Brahmar Panam. Arpanam refers to the instrument with which the offering is made. The ladle used in the sacrifice and other such instruments are transcendental or Brahma. What is offered, such as the ghee and grains, is also Brahma. Brahma Gno means that the resting place of the sacrificial fire and the sacrificial fire itself are Brahma. The Brahmana who performs the Yajna is also Brahma. Thus Brahma, the Supreme, is the only desirable object for a wise man. There is no other result. If one asks why, the answer is that this activity is identical to Brahma and therefore it leads to Samadhi, exclusive concentration of the mind. No other fruit is obtained. Sarardavarshini Prakashikariti In sacrificial acts, the special instrument used to offer ghee into the fire is called sruva. The ingredients offered to the demigods in the sacrifice are called havi. Srila Bhaktivinoda Thakur quotes Krishna as saying, Here, how work in the form of sacrifice gives rise to knowledge. I will explain various types of sacrifice later. Now, I will explain the fundamental principle behind it. Material actions are compulsory for the living entity who is bound to material consciousness. In such mundane activities, the faithful discharge of prescribed duties in which one can deliberate on spiritual reality or chit tattva is called yagya. When conscious reality manifests in matter, it is called Brahma. That Brahma is merely my bodily effulgence. Spiritual reality, chit tattva, is quite distinct from the whole material universe. Yagya is perfect when its five constituents, namely arpanam, the instrument of offering, havi, the ingredients, agni, the fire, hota, the doer, and pala, the fruit, are the resting place of Brahma, that is, when they are meant for the revelation of Brahma. A person's activity is known as Brahma Yagya when he seeks revelation of Brahma in his actions with concentrated meditation. The instruments of offering, the ingredients, the fire, the doer, that is, his very own existence, and the fruits are all Brahma. Thus, their ultimate destination is also Brahma. <laughs>